Somebody clap those hands and give God a shout. We are live on Sweet Melodies 94.3 FM. Also live on Sweet Flow 102.1 in the city of Tamale and its environs. We are live on Amansan TV, live on Facebook, live on YouTube. Ladies and gentlemen, I welcome you dearly to the W3 service. My name is Kofi Odro. This is Alabasta International Ministry bringing you this live broadcast service. We're going to be with you from now until 8 o'clock. We are so, so blessed to come into the comfort of your homes, your cars, your workplaces. And it's an honor to be with you this morning in Jesus' name. Shall we be upstanding for the reading of God's word? Our foundation scripture, John chapter 12, verses number 20 and 21. John the 12th chapter, the 20th and 21st verses. John chapter 12, verses number 20 and 21. The Bible said there were seven Greeks among them that came up to worship at the feast. The same therefore came to Philip, which was a beside her of Galilee. They desired him, saying, Sir, we want to see Jesus. The same therefore came to Philip, which was a beside her of Galilee, and desired him, saying, Sir, we want to see Jesus. And then so, every day, the next 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 Na hila fubu wa wana wapaa sorry besu ya fashion na sinimu. Eno wapaa filipu au filipu ya isaida wa gelele ya nonche. No bekache ya nise urua ya pesi ya huni yesu. Eno wapaa filipu au filipu ya isaida wa gelele ya nonche. No bekache ya nise urua ya pesi ya huni yesu. Also further we would like to read Luke the 21st chapter. The 34th to the 36th verses. Luke chapter 21 verses 34 to 36. The Bible said take heed to yourselves. Least at any time your hearts be overcharged with suffering and drunkenness and the curse of this life, and so that they come upon you on a worse as a snare. It shall come upon all them that dwell on the face of the whole earth. Watch ye therefore and pray always, that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. Watch ye therefore and pray always, that ye may be accounted. Yes, I can kind of put a case of me. If you look at some pub, said the uh, you more a year, the son, nine a copy media, sir, in Sia, if you need to say, you know, I could look at and some pub said, you look at Charity Bray and it's a year, you know, I could eat more, yet you are son, nine a copy media, sir, in Sia, Tiffin Dray and Sako, Tia, a radia. Namon Shamu, Napochan, and Sabron, and Quemonia Mahonda, Jenny, how Anshama Kumaso, Nadana Betum perfume is a fidi. Never know what Tia Sassin in any in Asso. And to Mon Ray Namon Shredder Away by Juma, it may to top Brenwa, you woman as a net or china, and a copem, Nadichia, yet a year brewing a bosom, and there to sweat your summer one son of fee, a bacon a year, and we and Renumere, your ho, and of course, yes, upon sending me news, yet this year, yeah, you know, now, uh, you know, or Yare, Nantem Kakra, now, and run or part was sorry, yeah, what it in Nimpomo, and I'm home, yes, of course, your man associate, and they call a superior team. Because you are already busy. Busy, you are a baby. 35, you know. Because you are weak. A prayer. You are quiet. 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 You are 
Obi be ko pu side party o me fie. It is three days from here. When you are not doing the work of God, you are not doing the work of God. It is me who am passing. Obi a worry ten one na se ompe ompe no ti ni e e ni abre a worry ten one na se ompe. Fidia ba ane fidia ba ma wobi kuno. Who batana ho wenche? Me kasa machira. Ebe onwa wase obo kalabahata, but ye be si e wa obre nzonye. Frisa, wu ni ahon he soa, he wu ye. Na po cha na nsabura na nkwa emu dabyo na wu ni ema, ham shawo, o o o o o di ye nso. Wakoma shawo. Ne dabi ba, ametu mpo fri mu se fidi ye. A diano, ye fidi sum, ye fidi ye. Debi ba ametu umpo fri musi fidi ye. Unzu waka wili ye. Pacha mwanti na siya humbra siya mbe ure ma yi set up take out prayer mbo this morning. It's gonna take a bit of time for me to, you know, settle down for us to cruise. And so, you know, unzu na anu nu waka wo yi timo ti uguma iti ya mi ansa. Na waka safa wunyamini pa ho. Isua efata kriso fwa sofu wano. Udru be bino waka ase wanyabe fo. Now, when I am caught up in some video, can you remember me? First Timothy chapter three verse six. First Tim, first Timothy, rather not Corinthians. First Timothy. Timothy, yeah, chapter three, verse six. Can you? Onya befo. Onya befo. Now, when I am caught up in some video, he should not be a novice, lest he be lifted up with pride and fall into the condemnation of the devil. Ahano or cancer. When I am caught up in some video, atemu. ตีนี่เองกันวันทบบนซ้ำอาทิตย์บุบวันเชียร์นับบนซ้ำเดินอาทิตย์บุบทุ่งโซอินเพจยังเคยหัวเยสวดีเพจเอาเอ็นวานุ
Atenomonium, and Shaw Cross and the Debiba, and Dano, and you feel you believe, maybe I'll call you chapter verse six of First Timothy, chapter number three. Now, the next verse, and I can't see me so he took none compass making Kaho. He should not be a novice, lazy fall. He falls into the condemnation of the devil, and in the next verse, number seven, he brings a snare of the devil the snare of the devil there is a snare the enemy sets Okay, and then last Sunday, you may cast some. You know, this is not the time to be jumping around. This is the time to reflect. This is the time to have an introspection and a retrospection and an inspection. A inspection, no, a inspection, no, she no, a introspection. Who will move a retrospection? Who will go and then you are cause so afraid. Now, by your inspection, taking an inventory and a stock of your life life how this year has been whether you wasted this year or you did something meaningful and something viable and something purposeful with your life this is the time to sit and you know we need to have an analytical assessment a critical assessment of your life wouldn't be awesome a critical assessment of your life, we need to come to that place. Yana mi huni ni pebi pa, e wa sorry dem na wamu nyaa shomo pa. Wamu di tinga mi fi mi tumi muzi wunya mi yedo. I'm telling you, it tells me that God is love because wunya mi he we jam an kan kanu usuba an phoneo, eh ukuno no e jume msika e na di ata ata di e show a wanya huwe chuma e na di ati police wunya mi ni e di ni e 2019 e wa beti na. This is what Ghana has offered. What's the What's the Yeah, this day, uh, and then a uh, very crucial. Very crucial. This is where we sit down and assess analytically. Critical analysis. What have I been able to do with this life? See, that is why when we were, you know, considering that parable of Jesus Christ, you know, that uh, uh, that was the scripture we read. We read that scripture and we read it, we read it on purpose because it was prophetical. Today, we are reminding ourselves after 12 solid months. Love solid man. The question is, did you wasted it, or you carefully invested it? Will you come here, Luke chapter thirteen, verse six. Luke the thirteen chapter, the sixth verse. Luke chapter thirteen and verse number six. The Bible said, and Jesus spake also this parable: A certain man had a fig tree planted in his vineyard, and came sought fruit thereon and found none. The Bible said, so he said to the dresser or the keeper of the vineyard, Behold, these three years I come seeking fruit from this fig tree and find none. Cut it down. Why cumbered it the ground? The Bible said further, and he answering and said unto the Lord, Lord, let it this year also, till I shall dig about it and dunk it. And in verse number nine, and if it bear fruit, well, if not, then cut it down. The Bible said in uh, 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 the same, but ten, uh, it's going to say something else, will it? 
Broduma and Swaba. Broduma and Swaba. Where you brought my pa, but on Swaba. With the Christo ni pa, but on Swaba. Her media me, Mr. Macacho, Semenya Sofwa, come a pass for the bitters alabasta. Namaqua Cotanase. Na metin church, papa. Nyamia sam yenu kure nyamia sam ensuru nyamia sam enfero nyamia sam enfa won se wo na wo ma yes kam ye di si asonda nyamia sam kura enfa won se wo e na wo ma ye is kam ye di atu aduetu nyamia sam won fa ho wo din se wo na wo nyamia sam be yi won tan e be kan wan di mu atu fo wo nyamia sam adia e ye me oh my god i want to talk to somebody the word of the lord is like a scanner the bible said the Trans of it brings light and gives understanding to the simple. The Bible said, All oh, perfect gift and good gift cometh from above, from the Father of light, in whom is no variableness nor shadow of pain. The word of God is sharper than every two edged sword, it cuts asunder to the separation of the spirit and soul as of the bone and marrow. The Bible said, The word is a discerner of thoughts and the intense of the heart. In other words, the word is like a scanner. It scan what is in you. It scan what is in your motives. What is in your brain. What is in your mind. What is in your heart. It goes deep into your heart and it goes into your intentions. It goes, why are you doing what you are doing? The word of God goes to that. The word it goes deep into that. But <laughs> Oh yeah, sometimes we need to be just paraphrase it, just let you get it. The revelation. Jeremiah 1711. I'm telling you. You can you can even have preachers talking nonsense. Talking nonsense because they are not used to this kind of presentation. Well, brace yourself because this end time, God has given us the grace to wipe out the mess you people have created. We are suffering so far from for our son them dim from far we won't know me a dear. It means you be scared of Johnny and nobody a dear. God has given me the grace to wipe out your mess which you created in the church. And instead of preaching the gospel, the pure content of the credit revealed and the engrafted word of God that is able to save our souls. We are rather talking about fairy tales uh, to the people. Some kind of human ideologies and some kind of theses to the people. And they sit down thinking you are talking wisdom. Well, the wisdom of God is not like the world. And I'm telling you, ladies and gentlemen, until you repent, you shall all perish. These are the words of Jesus. Until you repent, you shall all perish together. Because judgment will begin from the house of God. It will begin with the preachers. God will start from the prophets. He will go to the bishops. God will make more church crowd there. Yam fem free muswan ke be me mama. Yen yam fem free yeswa. E be me mama papa. Yeah yeah yeah. I'm telling you. Sit down. Will you come home to you? Emma bonne for some no so. Emma bonne for some. Bonne for some. Emma ne no so. Ne nyo kwasi anso. Wasi enye kwasi ya. 
and you walk as Matthew 25, and Mabba went to be Tasuan Kanya Zoko Jafukuru, Nenumi and Quasia, and Sonoma and Mabawa. In the Yamanga, here were Christopher Quasia for woman at Jeremiah 422, Kawam was seven. Was a bit my head, Jimmy, where a man Quasia for, where your Bonunians are for Papa Winnie. I'm telling you. Would you be kuna when you can see a dear and I? A man, my door, so I hear Peggy, I were in two. Yeah, who are we available? Well, be dear and I batter. What can I say? A woman, you are a dumb asset. I'm not, I'm not joking. I don't know who be asset. But how can you escape if you neglect so great a salvation that has been presented to you? That Jesus died a painful death on the cross for you. Jesus died a very painful death for you to be living hypocritically. I'm telling you. 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 I'm you. I'm telling you. you. I'm telling you. i you. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. I'm you. To everybody that is listening to us, even as the year is going to a close, and we are grateful to God for His benevolence and providence from the beginning of the year until now, even as the year is going to a close, and we have a retrospection and look back, and we are grateful, showing gratitude unto God, even for this nation, that no matter what happened under the carpet, that the message of God is still generous towards our leader, despite all kinds of views that went under the carpet oh yeah even you know as we remember what god has done for us that ebola came into the region and never entered our country even as we look back we are grateful even as we look back to some of the judgments in our court and we think and cannot understand god's mercy will still overshadow yeah the message of god is still keeping the people that killed fennec orchard and killed captain mahama the message of God is still hovering over the people that killed J.B. Dankwa Edu. The message of God will still be hovering over the people that killed Ahmed Swale. The message of God will still be hovering. The people I'm on the ballpark and my The message of God is still giving you an available opportunity to repent from your wickedness and from your madness and from your your slander and from your adulteries and from your drunkenness the message of God is still hovering showing you kindness yes yes the message of God say your message of God I don't know I don't know I'm telling you you will not be here. What's that man? For someone knows, and they know what he sees. Read. But your and your opening focus. Any pressure? I didn't see now. We will be. We will bring you. A DNT. Why die before your time? Why are you going to? In other words, people have died before their time. A brand new show. You've wasted time, wasted opportunities, years. Why die before your time? As I finished my presentation this morning, I just wanted to, you know, let you understand that, you know, it is around this time that we look at certain critical counsel of the law and, and look at it. Because your attitude towards the world is different. Maybe let me turn it around. Your attitude towards the gospel is different. Yeah. I can't be. I can't be. I'm telling you. And that is why, you know, you won't scan it out there. We will choose money over everything. I'm telling you. Assembly man, be an honor. You're teaching any fry for a sick man. So, I'm going to teach any fry for. What the half of scanner man, you're the attorney, you're going to stool. 
Don't forget that. Yeah, when young Repentance to Christ Jesus. I'm talking to you. You better hear what we are. We are talking to this awesome. Because these are all byproducts. Byproducts. If you seek it first, the kingdom and its righteousness, the cars will follow, the houses will follow, the money will follow. I'm telling you, if you go following the money, it will be vexation of spirit and chasing of the wind. I'm telling you, and the Bible calls us vanity. Oh! It's vanity. Vanity. Wouldn't me more man. I want to bro for vanity. All is vanity. I'm telling you, vanity. And I see people chasing vanity. And it's because of the kind of messages that have been disseminated from your pulpit. Yeah. It, it means that if you don't have a car, you are not blessed. If you don't have a house, you are not blessed. And, and uh, it's so sad that it has come into the body of Christ to the point that if you can't give $10,000, $20,000, you are not a good son. Yeah. That is the kind of precedence we are setting. And I'm telling the body of Christ, wake up! You have been sleeping. You have been sleeping with your leaders. I'm telling you, you better wake up to reality and look up because money is not everything. I'm telling everybody in this place, you will come to a place in your life where money cannot pay for your life. A day will come. You will want money to pay for life and it cannot. It will not be winning quite ya papa. Go to the car park right now. You will see cars. Mercedes, BMW, Range Rovers. Right now, go and see. That car will be in the befa. The day they lift your coffin, somebody will drive the Range Rover away. Your wife, <laughs> you know, the guy said, me, so my mommy be you know what from saying about ne papa ne so from saying about and when the man of god died you know his brother on the same day of his death came to the house and told the woman of god car ne sa fu anwe where is the keys to the car he said which car he said your husband's car me too i will drive it on the day of his death tianye Ya odi wa kuma die chire no beja inte pedie empro hwehwe die empro adwen such the name Christo Jesus so e konkwagiam eternal life this is what i'm talking to you about eternal life say your eternal life in tinate are you are wasting your time I'm telling you, if it is if you are not here because you want to see Jesus, the shepherd, the good shepherd, if you are not here because of the way, the truth, and the lie, if you are not here because of the door, if you are not here because of Jesus, who is the resurrection and life, if you are not here because of Jesus, the resurrection, the living bread, and the bread of life, then you are wasting your time because human beings have nothing to offer you we are all flesh and blood we shall all die and be extinct but i'm telling you ladies and gentlemen they that trust in god shall be like mount zion they shall not be removed oh yes sir yeah 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 not everybody that said unto me lord lord will enter the kingdom of heaven but they that do it the will of my father which is in heaven and you want more see me sir I even like it in first John chapter 2, verse number 15. As a moon no reassay, and I near me woman, or be to reassay, a Johnny Tony Ninimo, than your word Yasina, or Nama Connor, and you are Connor, as it never were in Fred Jano, 
it is not of the father but of the world but i like the next verse but the world passed away with its last thereof but there or he that doeth the will of the father shall abide forever yeah there that focus focus on what we are doing there that do what the will of the father shall abide for it. they will remain if he shall appear he shall appear with them yeah if he shall reveal himself they will be revealed with him if he sits in his kingdom we will also sit with him if he reign we will reign with him oh yeah that is what i am talking about not the temporariness of what you are in no a day is coming we will all leave this earth American visa. I'm telling you. What's it to me? I say here. A chain, you couldn't know a woman. And what's it to me? You are saying here, chain, you didn't know a woman. Am I talking to anybody? Yeah. And what's it to me? You are saying here. And what's it to me? You are saying here, chain, you won't summon here. Your wheel, la, why you know? Yeah, and what's it to me? Assemble. What I'm talking to you about this morning should be more pertinent and more crucial and important to you, more than your pension. The amino kano you know we? I am far important than the house you are building. They can't say much to you. See, that is what he said in in First Timothy chapter number six. He was talking when he he was talking about the concept of life. In verse number six, he said, "You know, um, godliness with contentment is great gain. It is certain we came into this life with nothing, and we shall exit with nothing." Yeah, you know when he he moved, you know he, he made it very clear categorically. It is certain. We came into this world with nothing. And we shall exit with nothing. And in the, you know, the act of verse, he said, and if we have clothes and if we are, whatever, you know, that we will sleep and whatever we will eat, we should be content with that. And then he went to the next verse to go and talk about something profound. When he finished that verse, will he next verse? Yeah, read the next verse. No, no, go to the next verse. Let's go. A young man was so free to be in Kawinchino. Ha! Men found your way up. A young Hufuru. A young Frama. A young Shira. I'm telling you. Men found your way up. Tinny. Will it kind of have us in the beauty? Now, when you're going to party, when you're mini party, Johnny Yenum, Johnny Wainum, Neditine, T. Anima. We Christians are so sure. You did it, Chiri. Tine, nyame sompa, nyame sompa. Jidiye, tine, tine, tine. Mumbi brion mama ko aso de munti weda over ten years because they need you to believe that life is all about gaining. I'm telling you, that is why musurose mubiu. Because when you're prepared, Tia! Ubetia! Ubetia! Slow, so, Ubi, who wants, hey, as much in a way. So, for Kurabu, near the boss of Framani, pray. Quite on a who say, Unzu, be, Ubi. Yeah. Yeah. Who say, you was as a Abraham also. Blessed are the dead that die in the Lord. In the Lord. It's a blessing. God take pleasure in the deaths of his saints. TNA. Some Jina. Yeah. 
Nene wape obe ebi yafa. Wapu wa honho. Asimbi ye ni ho. Adia ye dear chile na is vanity. Will you? Kind of expression. Pacho se. Best man ye wei. Pacho 11. Kind. Na wu nyanku poni pa de jani ye inu mne ditine ne. Oh ya. Ditine ne. O nyame sompa. But thou man of God flee these things and follow after righteousness, godliness, faith, love, patience. Patience. Mu niya botere. Mene wu na ye niya botere. Abo botere kwa ye di kwe wu nyame boshe ye nipi. Mu niya botere. Get up. Let's get me more chairs and all those people standing. I don't want them to get up. All the team, get up. Let all those people come and sit down. Abutria say you don't have it. We don't have it. You need. Although I don't want to talk about it, when I look at the hate, the level of hatred in the in the pulpit, it's unbelievable. Call baby, I met some so for penny in Naya Dono, you know, and I said, Hello, Papa. Messi, I was shocked. I didn't know that people hate me to that point. I never believed that there is hatred that can come from a church father. I was in a meeting the other day. You know, and uh, sitting next to a huge bishop, he looked at me and said, Oh, hi, you will crum up. And I'm sitting there very obstructed, and I'm asking myself, What is it I'm doing apart from disseminating the truth of God's word? I said, The kind of crap, a hell will be. The kind of crap, a hell will be. Neminim her barber swafi e bano eni no kureno entu a wude tu. I'm telling you, na yen na eni msa no kureno kobe biya. You because you cannot do anything against the truth except for the truth. You can never do anything against the truth except for the truth. I'm telling you, let your yes be yes and your no be no. Anything apart from that is evil. Oh, is evil. Is evil. You see, but when people come to you talking nonsense about other people to you, remind them that they should add it, that they also, you pay their school fees for them. You also took care of their children. You also, they don't add that to the gossip. Let them be reminded that you can only say negative things about your ex-husband and negative things about your ex-wife and negative things about your ex-boyfriend and negative things about your, you know. And so I am asking, where is the Christian virtue in you. I want to ask that profound question. The year is going to a close and this is the time to forgive. This is the time to forgive. Forgive all the people who despitefully used you and said all manner of evil about you. I'm telling you. Oh yeah. Look them in the eyes and say you have not yet said sorry but I forgive you. And only Christianism. Yam sompa. A can yam sompa. That is why I say pass or a papa. Neko and so the food ye be a bagana hapa. Woman ya so the funens as of a phone and woman back. Can kwa see as some chili in the pameka so much you and that is why moon pen ukren ten ukre because on my ya woman in ukrainim. No kura pa in um penny for being can ukre was of for being can ukre and mumu being some pen ukre. Omaya you will be. Nanka mo um penny full ne bono crabosso. So we may ye bema na ye ye. Where that crack or break ye be ye. Um penny for you know who may cut so much. Woman you know who. Crack or break ye ye mine. Come so sabri ye kukura si kung konso. Na na side chicks. Any honorable to first class. Ni yiri nimso ni 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 yitu kwa in. Na gana in the yitu ya saka. And then we turn and say, so amani niska. 
ye jai sam penafu ya wo musunni mfaso bi ama wo mani wo nyame ahini age apopa kan kan en wo mubu ye jai we no more we can use all and salvage all the waste and build our country proper hospitals proper schools proper agriculture proper banking system proper financial sector proper business entrepreneurship and investment and all proper things will be done brafundi monko so we be we school nya adwuma nya we nurse fu a we school for 4 years they don't have employment i just want to sorry akoye dey dey with ministries now you want to share baby and and so sector minister jina ketua ne pay them all the time pepe 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 ade a wo mu chiri ne ne me ye se wo beka wo mo ba wo mo bra wo ne hwan se wo beka i'm telling our leaders bring the camera god will judge you. God will judge you. I'm telling all our leaders, God will judge you. God will judge you. Will you come back from your first minute? Kujidi ye kupa. Kujidi ye. Ahana me pese uti ye ye. Right now, the year is coming to a close. If there is something that you need to reflect with your life, is this. Fight the good fight of faith. Lay hold on eternal life. Whereon to thou also are called and has professed a good profession before many witnesses. Will you come on him too? So down kwa a wopo. So down kwa wabudi ayadiya. Afre wono. Afre wono. Na wopay o muka anu yie adanse fopi inu eni muno. Read the next verse. Metu o funya kopo a o mani yombe nina an kwa ni kriso yesu a. Afre wani kriso mwa futu o e. Me too for when you go on a when you go on a or money or menina and qua and the crystal yes or pay mukan ye didn't want dance here punch up lato and you know set share a shadiano so shadiano a shadiano de me me preach you when we so and madame anasa assembly my home so no you know you know it is not a complete statement incomplete statement the complete statement will be Resonate, resonate this, resonate this, resonate, resonate, resonate. Me a catch on ya, you know. Tia ye, tia ah. So then you come up, oh, we nanga na so we order that and make one inamu. Enye nuni here, enye nuni here. Resonate yo, resonate. Di ye di a show, a show di ano. Resonate. Osi me resonate. A madam anasa asembi maho tiheyi asemu awatenu tiheyi na demu ananke ka na asembi a ma asemu awatena no pe read kosi se yen eradi yesu kristo ahu yi no so my god na chese kristo yesu ne dia mutu mumu time oba read eno na dia obetre ebre a asemu ne ahuto tunfo kro no okay ahini mu hine ni eru no mu eradi read dia ono nku wo dan kwa a owo ni mu wase wo dia Stand to your feet, let's close. Clap your hands for the Lord. Will you count to us? The Onuku Dankwa Uunimu. Say hi out. The Dankwa and Anim Kwan Uunim. And you didn't walk out, said you were Jimmy Din, you were Wumpa. Uwenyankwa. I'm telling you, he that believes in me, even if he were dead, he surely shall live. Because in him is life, his life, it, there is no death in his life. Thank you. Thank you. I can't wait. 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 No, what he has here said, we soon be binding the year. Be what will you kind Jeremiah 7? Jeremiah chapter 7. Once we are all still standing, I bring the message to a close. My catch will be the fact that we are about standing. Just a walk on heaven. I'm telling you, huh? Being in Alabaster, everybody watch this. Being in Alabaster, it's like 
sitting in a plane or sitting in a bus or a coach or a car. The car is not the destination. The plane is not the destination. The plane or the bus is a vehicle or is going to transport you to your destination. It has suddenly you vehicle. Now, what happened to Nakemo? You drew a cacras, Muninama Munso. Near Jinam Wagunso, you drew baby as Muninama Tuntusu. I feel your cotton to sue by us, and none could be you. Nabas in Egina on the train. Mumbe brought my bass here to a jam. Waka Quentin, Fimam Cachero, who gives you from our door, Waka Quentin. The bass has left you. Tears from Minoka. And that vehicle. As long as you go with the you go with the conscripts and the dictates of the vehicle, you know, it takes you to your destination. When you sit in the plane, they said buckle up and then you know sit up and all that kind of thing. When the plane is taking off in London, your seat must be upright. These are some of the rules that goes with flying. You know, you cannot say that uh, I'm going to the lavatory whilst the plane is taking off. There are rules that goes with it. The Bible said, He that ran it in a race does not win except. He, he ran according to the rules. Yeah, according to the rules, not according to what you think. According to the rules. Without the compliance and the obedience to the rules and the obedience to the word of God. Forget it. That is one of the reasons why in Jeremiah, you know, will you come here to Jeremiah chapter 7 and near me is the, is the what do you say? And they see nothing wrong with it. You will be shocked. Hey, Jesus, my Lord. And the home is sane. Amend your ways. My what time? And no one ye, my ye. Willie me in Chasso, at the Beko F5 service, Yami Aduma, 31st night is happening at the uh, Fadama School Park. All roads are leading, are you clapping? To Fadama School Park. After today's service, the next service is the prophetic crossover happening at the Fadama School Park. Myself, my wife did it, and Reverend Nanaya Osafo, we come together to bring you the prophetic crossover 2019. You can't miss it for anything in the world. It's an all-white service. It's a prophetic. It's anointing. It's going to be awesome. 8 p.m. The service starts 2 a.m. We close and we go home. Home. It's going to be an us. Yeah. And the Lord will bless you. I want to use the opportunity to thank God for His Royal Majesty uh, uh, Nana and Sakwao, the fourth, and Ohineire gifted. I want to use the opportunity to thank the Queen Mother also of uh, Edmasa, my uh, Nana Bracket too. We want to thank you very much for inviting us to the Royal Palace of Edumasa uh, to preach the gospel of Jesus Christ on Christmas Day. The Lord bless you, Nana. Uh, uh, we had the privilege of meeting so many, many chiefs. We met the Omaihine of Dodua. We met the uh, Ohine of Senchi. We met, you know, a couple of Ahimfo. It was such a great blessing to preach the gospel. And I, I, I'm so amazed and shocked the way Ahimfo, no, you know, received the gospel and all that. It, it was humbling. That's it. 25th. Next year, you are the chairman. You me. me. It you know, uh, a rare name we say that it's a bit cheap. Everybody who is in Shlomo, do you remember my name was telling me I follow you, I watch you. I'm saying, 
Kanya ukura na beka meba mwe ya sasa ya mamedi ya yasu. Meba mwe ya sasa ya mamedi ya mepeni ya wako ahoni ya diya feeling station. Efe miyasare. Praise the name of the Lord. Let me use the opportunity to wish His Excellency the President happy and prosperous New Year. I thank you very much, Your Excellency, Mr. President. And I want to thank God for our mother, Lady Rebecca. And thank God for, you know, your leadership. We want to really appreciate God for all of you. And uh, we also want to thank God for the great work that has been done, especially the free SHS. But uh, since His Excellency, you have declared next year the year of roads. I will be on my knees vehemently, aggressively, belligerently praying that God will bring that dream and vision to pass. As a matter of fact, we have so many crazy, unmotorable things we cannot call a road. And so, Your Excellency, may the Lord bless you and keep you prosperous, grant you the wisdom and the strength so that you can be able to administrate a very astute and stringent leadership in your governance. May the Lord be with you in the coming year. God bless you richly. Can I do that without saying a good morning and a happy new year to my mother, Dr. Christy Dolteta. I love you, mommy. You are such a blessing. Also want to thank God for my father, uh, my father, Steve and Stanley Mensah. I want to really honor you, Papa, for honoring God for my life. I don't joke with you at all. I also want to thank God for my MP, uh, MP for Okainkwe Central, Honorable Patrick Yaubuama, and Deputy Minister of Sanitation. Thank you very much, Honorable uh, Afishapa. We really honor God for you and Asetana Winiatana Ewo Ipumoha Saints. You know, I was born here and grew here as yourself. The Lord bless you richly. I really appreciate you. Ghana Funa, Yamamu Afishapa, and Ope, Epesia Bompa, Yamao May. We want to ask the grace of God for our country. We are thankful that God has been so merciful to us that unlike so many countries that had bombings and shootings and all kinds of things, Ghana has received the grace of God. Say amen. amen. Hallelujah. Wherever you are in an attention position, your hand is on your chest. We will sing the national anthem and we will ask God to honor the words in the anthem and ask our prayer in Jesus' name. Amen. <laughs> With all I will and might forevermore. And help us to resist our present truth. With all I will and might forevermore. Can you stretch your hands on our national flag and pray for Ghana? Pray for Ghana, pray for Ghana, pray for Ghana. Our country needs God. Pray for our city. Pray for our economy. Next year we are going into elections. Pray for the elections. Pray that the grace of God and the hand of the Lord will visit this country. Soyamu, 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 
my God, so you so you my Lord, so you mo ne dibuai, ma di ene ni mo ene nyi. Esela wa humba mboni wa dum di ama, ama mpeni akufuado. So you Come ahead, Dibu. I don't know when you are a machine and you are a machine. CSA, to your prayer, a time for any information, Hallelujah. So, Father, thank you for the whole of 2019. Thank you. Thank you for this nation. Thank you for how far you've brought us. Thank you for your mercies and grace. I pray your hand of blessing of our Ghana. Forgive our sins. Heal our land as we rend our hearts. I pray for our president and our mother, his dear wife. We pray that your hand of blessing will be on the first family. Grant them, the, grant them the grace and the covering and victory. Grant His Excellency strength. Strength. Strength of conviction. To be able to do what is righteous in your sight. In the name of Jesus. I pray that everybody who is within his government plaguing havoc and wrecking that which he is building, expose them and judge them in the name of Jesus. I pray for Ghana's missions all over the world. Let your hand of blessing be on them. I pray in the name of Jesus that your grace will be upon the people of Ghana. We commit ourselves into your hands concerning the coming year. That you are well able to do exceedingly abundantly above everything that we can think, ask, or imagine. Be kind and usher us into a new year. In Jesus' precious name. Now may the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord favor you. May the Lord entrench his favor and mercies upon you. May the Lord surround you with grace like never before. In Jesus' mighty name. Amen. But I cannot leave without giving everybody who watch and listen the opportunity to give your life to Jesus Christ. Your hand is on your chest. Can you say, dear Lord Jesus, dear Lord Jesus have, mercy have mercy on a sinner like me. On a sinner like me. Wash me, wash me in the blood. In the blood. Cleanse me. Cleanse me. Write my name. Write my name in a book of life. In a book of life. Today. Today. I receive eternal life, eternal life into my spirit. Into my spirit. I am born again. I'm born again. I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. For answered prayer. For answered prayer. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 One more time, ladies and gentlemen. This has been the W3 service. I want to thank Sweet Melodies 94.3 FM. Thank you very much for working with us throughout 2019, broadcasting the word of the Lord all over. I want to use the opportunity to thank God for Amansan TV, the GN group, and tell them that uh, it is well. The Lord bless you and uh, help you and keep you in Jesus' name. I also want to thank God for... Uh, the Despite Media Group, I want to extremely give God the glory for their lives, for our group chairman, Dr. Ose Kwame Despite, and his brother, Dr. Ofori Sapon. We want to thank God for your lives. Thank you very much to uh, my MD, Dr. Father Dixon, and my general manager, Mr. Kennedy Ose. I'm grateful for everything. The Lord richly bless you and keep you. I also want to thank God for all the people who work in the Despite Media Group, and uh, especially Adesia Ewoho Winyamensa 
and uh, what a famous way in I want to thank God today, especially for Akosia Sapo of UTV, and thank God for Edward Bediakum of UTV, and thank God for Nanaya Kunedu of Peace FM, Mamebi Yama of Peace and OK FM. Thank you very much. We really appreciate God for your life. Nanaya Jessica, we appreciate you as well. Now, I will use the opportunity to thank God for Vision One, 93.5 FM and Light TV. Thank you very much. Dr. Kwame Che, his honor. Professor, I salute you this morning, your wife and your family. And uh, I will want to thank God extremely for the life of Reverend Nanaya Osafo. We are too much. The Lord bless you, Nana, wherever you are. See you in the next service. The Lord richly bless you for working with us throughout the whole of this year. I want to thank God for you all. Without you, we will be speaking to empty chairs. Thank you. And then Zumi Amwemiem. I'm grateful. Now, tomorrow, uh, we are going to need help tomorrow evening and uh, Tuesday morning. We're going to, you know, even if, you know, you're not a member of Alabaster, you follow the ministry, we'll need the help of young men and women come around to the Fadama Park as we set up for the big night, uh, you know, and be a blessing. The Lord bless you richly. Like never before. You can call the ministry line 0249 That's 0249 Fellowship with us in any of our branches in London uh, at Finchley Woodhouse. We start at 12 noon uh, at Alabaster City at Sapeman. Alabaster City, when you get to Sapeman, taxi rank us. We start at 9.30. North Carnation starts at 9. Uh, we are referred to him and starts at 8. East Legon Hill starts at uh, 9.30. Uh, join us in any of the services, including our next service here, uh, F5 service starts at 9 o'clock. Lord bless you and bless you and bless you and bless you. When righteousness becomes a lifestyle, breakthroughs, it becomes automatic. I love you. God bless you. See you all next time. See some of these hypocrites. I'm an entertain to my bad now. So Look at the bar. Now, send to our to now. So the wind can to announce them. I'm going to make the king a mess of the And the assembly, the idea, 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 the of being born again. A relationship is with Jesus Christ is what makes you born again. Today, we don't talk about being born again. But the question is, are you born again?
many, many, many. Papa Penny Moon and Camille will poor Cassidy. A Tama friend, your mother said you could eat insect. Where you know it's about the Tony Papa and Pass. What you were saying? We are just so born. I can't imagine. You are judging me. We are not judging you. We are reproving you. We are not judging you for wearing all kinds of promiscuous and malicious dressing into the house of God. We are reproving you. We are not judging you. We are not judging you for sleeping with somebody's wife. We are only bringing the divine correction to you. We are not judging you, you know, for being rebellious and insubordinate. We are not judging you for being disobedient, you know, to parents and disobedient to the counsel and to the word of God. We are only bringing divine correction and reproof to you. We are bringing a word of righteousness and chile chile to you we are not judging you we are only bringing you into alignment of the council of God now a we are not judging you for stealing money in government we are only reproving you because whatsoever a man soweth that also he shall reap we are not judging you for causing abortion we are only reproving you for all the wickedness you are purporting and tell this government we will not judge you we are only reproving you for all the things you do in the dark cover it up with blatant lies we are not judging you we are only reproving you that God will judge all of you we are telling all the board chairmen of all government agencies departments and uh, ministries all the board 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 of one would you pay them for nothing we are not judging you we are only reproving you that you are still return the day will lift your casket it will not be going with your easily gone property documents the day will lift your casket just like honorable jb danko and do your land cruiser will not follow your lexus will not follow your mercedes will not follow the people you are not even taking care of and take over your property no as we are we are not judging the time has come for judgment to begin in the house of God